So guys, I uh, screwed up the other day and I actually put E85 in my 2015 F-150 EcoBoost, which technically it's not supposed to have E85 ran through it. Now, the dealership said that my truck wouldn't even start with E85. And I am actually driving with the 85. And this is actually my second tank that I put in it. I just filled up with it again. Now, this is my fuel mileage with the E85. 14.3 miles per gallon, which isn't as great as regular gas. But you can see that I already ran 30 gallons through there and over 400 and some miles right now now I've heard that there could be issues with uh, your um, fuel lines going out um, and other parts going out in your motor and stuff and that it's really bad for your vehicle but I don't I haven't lost any power in my truck. Actually, it feels like there's more power in the truck. Um, more like if you're running premium instead of regular. Uh, but I did notice one thing that did pop up on the truck, and it's right there. Now, that's the engine light that came on, and the reason why that came on is because the O2 sensor is actually reading that it is not putting out the pollution or um, something like that it's actually I guess with uh, E85 it actually runs um, it burns and then produces more oxygen and that's why it trips the uh, O2 sensor there so um, it goes to show that you can run E85 and I was told that um, as soon as I start running regular fuel back in it that O2 sensor will correct itself and then the engine light will go off but as is right now I only have about 5,800 miles on my truck and my uh, engine lights on so after this tank right here I'll switch back to uh, regular gas and I'll see if my O2 sensor goes off